Hey everyone, I uh, hope you're well. Going to continue to pump out a few riff tutorials over the next few weeks that cover all of the great riffs in my recent riff battle videos from 1970 and 1971 to be continued. Uh, you can check out these videos down below in the description box if you like. Uh, today we're going to have a look at how to play the very cool and recognizable riff from CCR's <clears throat> The Hollies, Long Cool Woman in a Black Dress from 1971. Fogarty actually sued the Hollies for plagiarizing CCR's Green River and won half the rights to this song, and rightfully so. Alan Clark, the leader of the Hollies, admitted as much that he was trying to emulate CCR's sound and Fogarty's vocal styles on the track. And it, an admiral attempt, but a, a, a bit too much on the nose, to tell the truth. But for the topic at hand, that's all irrelevant. Uh, it's a fabulously constructed opening riff, and really fun to play and get rolling under your fingers. Or, to be more precise, finger. Uh, it's almost entirely played with one finger, but uh, we'll get to that. Let's show you guys and gals how to play it. All right, so we're in standard tuning uh, for this one, and uh, the, the opening riff goes a little bit like this. And then it's into the uh, when the singing starts. So uh, very, very cool riff. And uh, like I said, it's mostly played with your middle finger. And you use your index once or twice, but uh, you can play this whole thing with almost one finger. So you're starting with an open, open E, open low E. And then a little hammer on to two from the open A and then grabbing the open D. So it's like downstroke, downstroke upstroke on the open D. And then you're going to slide into five of the D string and then an upstroke on the open G. And then you're just going to progressively move this down, down to four, and then open G, open B, move it down to two. Open G, open B. And it's down, down, up, down, down, up on those three notes. And then you're going to grab the open D and then upstroke on the open G. And then you're going to do a little hammer on again from open A on to two, grabbing the open D. And now you're into a little G shape using your index finger for the first time. Little G shape here on the top three strings. Just play down basically the G chord there on the, on the, uh, the, the top three strings, or some people would call those the lower three strings. I call them the top three strings. And now you're going to back it up to uh, the second fret of the low E and hit the open A, open D. Back into the G again. And then you're going to slide into the fifth fret, uh, the A note at the fifth fret of the low E. And grab the open A, open D. And then finish the whole thing up with back to the G, open D, back it up to the second fret of the low E, open A. So slowly. and then repeat the whole thing over again. And 
and then we're into the chords. The blues. That little blues progression there. So, and uh, when, you're, when you're playing that down, the, the, you know, the top three strings, and then on the upstroke, catch the, uh, the second fret, which you're already barring on uh, the second fret of the D string, catch that on your way up. And then, you know, four or five, that little blues progression there. progression G A back to E and that's pretty much it for that one that'll get you through almost the whole thing and uh, just a great little uh, opening riff though really really nice to play If you were looking to learn a long cool woman in a black dress, uh, I hope that helped you out. And uh, you guys take care of yourselves. We'll see you next time. Cheers.